I living in Boulder Vlog, February night, Tuesday, nine forty-eight a.m. My mom was freaking out on me this morning, telling me she thought I needed to get exercise and get in shape. She came over here yesterday and. Gave me my blood pressure with this machine that she borrowed from her friend, and it said that I had a. I got stoned right before she came here, but it said I had a pulse of 101 and a blood pressure of. Um, 97 over 130. But then we waited five minutes, and then she took it again, and it was 89 over 130 with a pulse of 98. So. So anyway, yeah, she was freaking out on me this morning, and I actually am having, like, asthma lately, the last week, or asthma, um, and she's freaking out and telling me I'm gonna die this year, so I don't know, it seems like she really wants me to get back in shape, like, start exercising, and she's, I think she said something about going to the gym today. Or not today because it's too cold, but um, so she's uh, in doing webinar now and I'm busy, so I can't call her right now. But I was thinking, to, I was thinking to myself seriously, like, hmm, maybe I should do what do it. Um, it would require me. Blocking out all the other things that I need to do. And then just being satisfied working on it at the pace that I can. If I'm doing that, you know, I would do more surface level. As you go forwardly in future, stuff changes, you know, the website layout changes, and so maybe it it'll get to the point where I won't be, like, obsessed. The problem is I keep building new things. I build all sorts of crazy things that, like, are way time-consuming, and I'm like, what the fuck? Like, I went, like, two days or something into this project just last month where I wanted to turn all of the mountains like Rocky Mountain National Park and Boulder County and everything, all of the whole frickin' Front Range Mountains into one giant ski resort. But I was going to build it all to scale. Like, I was going to build... I was. I mean, I, not I was going to build. I built a bunch of... I'm going to have it for download. I don't think I have it for download yet, but I built a bunch of ski lifts. Every 200 meters, a tower, and I built the two cables. Not just one cable, two cables. And I built it, you know, 10 meters high, like realistic looking towers. And then I, all the trails, I built the trails all over. And so it's like, geez. So, um, but there's a lot, you know, but yeah, so I don't know, you know. Um, um, we'll see. Because that, that would be kind of interesting. Um. You never know until you, I guess, try it. But I don't know. I don't see myself. I've never done it. I've never started to get back in shape just because my mom wanted me to before. Um, but anyway, so that's that. But I was listening to lots of, like, uh, quantum mechanics videos and... Um, uh, not really understanding... Delayed Choice Quantum Eraser. I want to watch it on the video again. Because I haven't watched it on the video. That's the problem. I guess I wasn't working. But, um, yeah, I want to figure that out. Because then I could then figure out what the hell it means to me. So, because I still can't wrap my head around the double slit. 
should just watch more of those. But uh, and I was, and, but I got this book because I have Audible, so I get a book every month. So the book I got this month was um, shit. God damn it, Chris Hedges. Hang on. Free lunch by by David K. Johnston. And he's telling the stories of all of the scams ultra wealthy did <laughs> on taxpayers like George Bush with his Washington or his Texas Rangers and buying it with borrowed money and then selling it and keeping the money, stuff that Donald Trump does, stuff like that. Anyway, um, but, uh, yeah, those two things. And then the thing that I was working on all day, I'm tracing trails. <laughs> and I'm tracing so many trails that I'm super interested in plugging it up. Yeah, and I don't know how long that's going to be, but um, I'm getting super detailed. There was the, you know, if there's something original, then I I trace it. So there was some giant subdivision in like North Denver that had bike paths all over it in a really symmetrical way. And I wanted to trace all of it because it was pretty and it would be an interesting thing to treat as like a chorus maybe and put on draw on there so I was going to draw it on it was I was but it was so time consuming I know because before I even started I was thinking to myself oh my god is this going to be more than I can handle so then I bounced and I looked at um Netherland again so there's some website called alltrails.com that has all the trails I don't know how much area they have on it but it's so I could get like screen capture and just put it on Google Earth and then traced over it and then because a lot of them when it's thick you can't see the trail so I just guessed you know and but it worked out well because then once you get to an opening there's the trail so but uh yeah there's a lot of them I mean tra <laughs> If there was a time for me to get, a pit, independently of my mom freaking out, because she's been freaking out a re, like on a regular basis lately. Like, it's been getting worse. And, uh, but independently of that, I mean, if it was ever a time where I would get, be tempted to get back in shape, it would be now, because I'm, I'm tracing all the trails on... Boulder County and around here, you know, something to myself, shit, why didn't I buy a mountain bike? I got this expensive as time trial bike. Um, but if I had a mountain bike, which is even cheaper than that, they're expensive. <laughs> cheaper than that. Damn, I could have fun on the trails, but I can't because it's winter. So, but, and I have a mountain bike anyway. I just don't have the new one, so I'm good enough with those ones that I have now. I don't need to be, like, prissy. So, uh, yeah, um, and this would kind of be something that I could fun, be, have fun doing, the patching and the... Uh, in fact, this is the perfect time to do that if I were to get back into shape because i do the patching and the tracing, and that would be along the lines of also, like, making courses for my Garmin and... It'd be a good supplementary work uh, to well on the website to do while I'm, um, you know, writing. So, yeah, maybe I will, you know. I think in the back of my head, I was having some, like, very fleeting thoughts or remote thoughts of, like, yeah, maybe now's a good time, maybe no, maybe now is a good no. So, um, I mean, it will make me smarter, and I'll be able to, understand this quantum physics stuff better <laughs> anyways let's keep this under 10 minutes uh so i'll make up my decision i want to talk to my mom <laughs> that can help me make my decision and then um no tomorrow so yeah all right i'll talk to you tomorrow